for another vlog. I feel like I haven't vlogged in forever. Even though I dropped the video Monday, I haven't filmed anything all week. And that's because I've been busy with my Etsy orders and trying to do the um, business, Instagram and all that stuff. So that's what I was working on. But we getting ready to head out because I need to get some supplies for um, more reefs. My husband and I are gonna sh um, ship out some reefs this morning. Hopefully stop by the Goodwill because it's right next door. I have a vision of a dresser that I want to put in Destiny's room. So if I find one, hopefully I do. I did the last time I went, but I didn't get it. So I hope it's still there, which probably not. Anyway, but I, I want to show you guys the outfit of the day. So I keep it simple. So I got my pray on it, pray over it, and pray through it t-shirt. I got some black leggings with my sandals from Walmart. But I want to show y'all this bag. Now, her name is Paola. Let me do it like this so you guys can see. Her name is Paola. Oh my gosh, she sent me this purse. You guys, it's a cross shoulder uh, bag because y'all know I love cross shoulders. It's just, I love them. They're my favorite purses. Anyway, she sent me this bag because I made her a wreath and she didn't have to do that, but she did. And I am so grateful. It is super cute and definitely my style. So thank you so much. But she also sent me a letter. And guess what? You guys, she has a youtube channel which i did not know so i will link her channel down in my description box i binge watched her videos yesterday and she does nothing but recipes and they look amazing so you guys go ahead over to her channel and show her some love and let her know i sent you guys so i will make sure to leave her link down in my description box but y'all oh my god i love this bag thank you so, so much i will make sure that i link my business it um well not my business well what am i trying to say my instagram for my etsy shop right here somewhere and you guys could go follow that page and then you know what i just did so i opened up a tiktok account now i've been holding off i ain't trying to sign up for no tiktok how long has it been out i never had a tiktok account i, I can't even tell you how to use it so I finally opened one for my Etsy shop as well. I don't know how to use it though, so I have to go, I feel so old, John. I have to Google how to make TikTok videos. <laughs> That's sad. I don't know how to use it, so I gotta learn so like that I can um, put videos of the Reese on there. Sorry for the lighting, you guys. It looks kind of weird. It's better. I felt so old. I'm like, I, I looked at it, I felt overwhelmed. Like, how do you even use this thing? But I'll put it on here as well, just so you guys can, if you have a TikTok account, you can go ahead and follow me on there too, because right now it says zero followers. <laughs> oh my God, that's so sad. <laughs> but we're on our way to drop off the packages and then we are going to, or well, I'm going to Goodwill. My husband's gonna drop it off because it's right next to each other. Sorry, my arm hurts. And um, hopefully they have like that tall dresser in there, which I doubt it. That was last week when I saw it, uh, which I think it was a good deal because it was, it was a tall, heavy duty dresser and it was only $49.99. I have a vision. It, that dresser in Destiny's room with a nice teal color paint of chalk paint. So hopefully I can find it. I'm supposed to be doing my nails today, but today's my husband's day off. So um, I chose to wait till tomorrow. I'll go tomorrow. Um, he ain't had a day off all week. So I, I prefer to hang out with him instead. <laughs> what else I had to Oh, last night. We went to church, you guys. It was Wednesday night. Um, it was our first time going on a Wednesday night. They've been doing this for like the past month or two. It's just like not scripted, just whatever the Holy Spirit guides you to do. Like not guides you to do, but guides the service is how it went. And man, that was one powerful service, wasn't it, John? It was good, like good. I was in my feelings in there. Um, so I'm so glad we went on a Wednesday night. I took the kids. They um, they actually paid attention, except for one of them. One of them fell asleep. <laughs> yeah, first time being off, so we could go. Yeah, because my husband worked night, so we couldn't go. 
Yeah, I know if you've been watching my vlogs, you can assume which one of my kids fell asleep in service that always falls asleep wherever we go. Comment down below if you know which kid did that. Um, but it was so, so good. So my arms are kind of sore from worshiping. I had my uh, hands up for quite some time. So I'm like, <laughs> like this. And then I was already sore from making reefs because um, I have arthritis. And then when you're bending down, working on the wreath, like my neck and shoulder pain hurt. So I'm gonna use my computer chair next time instead of the kitchen chair to sit down because that one made my butt sore. And now my hips hurt, everything just hurt. But that's what I've been doing all week. I've been working, um, didn't even film a clean video. I just did not have the time. Um, what else? Another thing I wanna do is, this Sunday is Mother's Day and I haven't even had a chance to do my hair. So what I was thinking is I need to take some time out after I do my nails to put some braids in. I miss it. I've been so busy. I haven't. I've been walking around looking like a chicken head. So that's another thing that I want to do. Hopefully I have time. Unfortunately, my husband has to work on Mother's Day, like from two to a twelve. So at least he'll be able to go to church with it, with us. But still, you know, it's just a point. We'll go for a service. I don't serve this Sunday. So let's hopefully we find something good at the Goodwill. I love thrifting. Thrif thrifting. Thrifting. So I just checked my P.O. box. And this is Miss Patricia Terry just sent me a Mother's Day card. Look how pretty this is. Hold on, let me see if I can focus on it. So, that's so sweet. I love cards. Good families need someone to raise them right, love them strong, and help them along. That's just the kind of mom you are and why there are days like today for celebrating you. Happy Mother's Day. God bless you and your beautiful family. From Miss P. Love your videos. Thank you so much. See, that just made my day. I'm happy now. Not that I wasn't before, but I'm extra happy now. So thank you so much. Okay, so I'm conflicted because this race is... Let's see, I can focus on it. Six dollars. But I like it. I don't know what to do. They don't have the dresser that I was looking for last time. Which I figured they wouldn't. Let me see. Oh, it's a Valentine's Day. Every... Trying to see. This little organizer. It's kind of like the Dollar Tree essential oil one that I have. Look what we found, guys. A Ray Dunn mug. It's actually $4, which is cheaper than it is in store, which is good. So I put the glass vase back. It was six dollars. You know, it's, it's overpriced. So um, I didn't find anything. I didn't find a dresser or anything. But all you gotta do is be patient. Maybe one day the right one will be there. I also checked Facebook Marketplace just in case, but um, didn't find anything. A lot of stuff in there is very overpriced. Like more than like I saw some Walmart stuff in there that's a dollar or two more than Walmart like where did they do that at? Thanks guys we're at Target <laughs> these are so cute they have a lot of summer barbecue stuff yeah I like that they also have these pictures A lot of cool stuff. You no, know, every time we come here, they didn't have anything. I like these lanterns because I feel like the colors go in the boys' room. You know, the blue and red that I'm trying to do in there. I don't even know. I feel like decorating the boys' room is so much difficult. Some of these towels I like. How much is this one? Five? They used to be three. I like this too, though. They have this one. Oh snap, please use our hashtag. Okay. A lot brighter. So they got the white one here, the white lantern. They have this. See, this is one of the boho themes that they have. But I don't need the mirror. these 
small little bases. These are cute. But none of the colors that I actually normally use. Yeah. Out to this one. Yeah, you are awesome, Dad. They are hampers. This is like the kid craft section. The kid, you know what, John? I'm really sad about the kids are growing this kind of stuff. The kids, the, the boys definitely been out grew this. Destiny still played with some stuff, but she outgrew some of this stuff too. These in here. USA dad joke stuff. David says that John has dad jokes. This is for shots. And so if I don't see anything here that I would use, I'm proud of me. Let's see here. This is for packing. Oh, mask. Oh, for mask. Okay. I like that. You can wash all your mask in there too. I like that. And then the organizer. This is three dollars. And they have the pretty dresses. Oh my god, I can't help myself, you guys. This is nine dollars. Oh my god. They're only nine dollars. Okay. All right, Destiny, I guess you could get, this is super cute. They're only nine bucks. I like this one. Let me put that in the cart. Oops, this is 15. These are cute. They're all cute, so I have to be careful. These are nine too. I like this one as well. Is a large? Yeah, she's a 10, 12, so. That goes in the cart. I got some Mrs. Myers cleaners. I do like the rose scent. I like a lot. Rainwater. I've never smelled rainwater before. Lilac is not my favorite. I'll get one. Oh, two bottles. Okay. But I do like the smell. Cleaners are fully stocked. Y'all know this is my section, right? So you can pretty much easily find, at least here, all of the cleaners. I never seen this one before. All purpose cleaner. It's an all purpose one. Oh. Bleach free. Okay, see, I would do it because it's bleach free, but I can't do it with bleach. Unless I I'm looking for an asthma attack. Let's see. They are the new Sentiva ones. These ones trigger my asthma as well. I wish I could use them. Because they do smell good. I just can't do it. John likes a peony, but I think it's, it's like very flowery. I like the rose one better, but they also have the Bona one. That one also kills germs. So they got this one you can buy the big one. Yeah, I, I would prefer like either you have a glass bottle or whatever. You could just, um, make yeah, it makes your own. It's cheaper to just get the concentrate. But see, when I was looking for this one, I could never find it. And look, they got a bunch of them in here now. Well, at least it's fully stocked. Ain't got no signs up saying you can only buy one. No, yeah, exactly. There's no limit anymore. So I guess we're moving to the right, right direction. And then there's this one. Never tried that one before. You guys, I love buying cleaners. I'm sorry. It's a problem that I have. <laughs> Isn't that right, sir? Uh -huh. But at least our house clean. I mean, shoot. Yeah, I like yeah, but the thing is, it would be crazy if I buy cleaners and then don't even clean the house. But I actually do. Y'all, look what's new. Look at this. Have y'all seen this before? Vinegar powdered clean, like detoxifying your clothes. What? Y'all see this? Wait, hold on. How much is this? I'm just looking, y'all. $11.99 in the 75 ounce load. Huh? Wow. Pot Tide also has the Pure Clean. Y'all ain't been in Target for a while because they have all the good stuff. Another scent on top. This one is Eucalyptus Mint and this one's the Lemon. Oh, wow, y'all. This must be near where have I been? Have this been out for a while and I didn't know about it? I never heard of it. Me either, but it's not like we come here every day. Let me Google it. Yeah, go ahead, sir. Go ahead. If I didn't have a bunch of laundry detergent at home, I would be getting this right now. Is this a fabric softener? Because it has a different top. Yep. That looks different. It looks like soap, too. I wonder what it smells like. 
no vinegar order left behind okay so this is what I wanted to see the I heard Grove had their stuff here in Target at Target so they got their glass water with the concentrate oh I thought that was so it's this one it's $14.99 so it's cheaper here than it is on the website it comes with one of the concentrations you could get the multi-purpose the glass cleaner and essential cleaners oh or you could have all three or oh, the tub and tile that's actually pretty cool glass cleaner and all that oh this is the orange scent this is actually cool you guys have y'all seen this at your stores i did hear about it on instagram also clorox has the compostable um, wipes now safe around kids and pets and it's free and clear so that's actually pretty cool and now I have the Dawn power wash free and clear as well and the refill so that's I was new. looking for the method there anymore, more and I can't find it so I'm gonna go ahead and try yeah, this one. gift cards for the teachers so now I am at Michael's and I love this port sign right here I need to stop and go look at the flowers down like the 4th of July stuff. It's cute. I like that sign right here. I came specifically to look for some tulips, but I cannot find it. I hope nobody brought it up. This is pretty. Lavender. Oh, I love this color. These are not the ones I'm looking for. The ones I'm looking for are in a bush. So one of these are $4.99. So pretty. I only found one thing of tulips, but that's it. Where's the rest? So I found some tulips. They have just a few. And then they have some white ones down here. What is this? It's 40% off. I got some pink ones. get some of these oops sorry 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 didn't mean to sorry all right get some of these all right i'm gonna pick that up all right and i need a few of these more okay. of the pink ones they're so pretty <sighs> tell you I can literally get lost in here I can be in here all day this is beautiful in here looking at the reforms this is a 10 inch because Hobby Lobby only got the 18 inch I noticed look at that one that's huge but I can be here in here forever I know this is the color scheme I have going on in the living room with the white and the gold but I opened it. Is it y'all? This $14.99. I don't know. I don't know about that. It's, it's a little high. All right, found the lamb's ear. I'll get a few of these. I love it. I have a wreath idea that I want to do. One, I'll say one, two. So I feel I love this black ribbon. I could do something with this. Y'all, this is my section. Like, I could be in here all day. All day. Make sure to get my sunflowers. Guys, tell me why my Hobby Lobby got Christmas stuff. Well, starting to have Christmas stuff. I, I remember last year I did a wreath with uh, this one of these pigs in here. Oh, I can't wait to start on those pretty soon as well. So they're not fully out there, but I guess they're starting to get stuff. So, wow. This was this. And I did use a lot of these for my wreaths too, these picks. I'm excited. I can't wait to start creating stuff for Christmas. I think this goes on sale for 50% off, but still, I know you can make something like this. You're pretty creative. You're pretty creative in your own way. Let's see what else they got in here. So I forgot to tell y'all. So yesterday, I just cleaned my house, right? And in the kitchen, I um, sorry, I'm so close. 
I kind of decluttered a little bit. I'm going to show you guys when I get to the house and I redecorated in there. So when we I get to the house, I will show you guys, but I kind of condensed some things down. I was feeling like it was a little, it was getting too cluttered in there. But sometimes I do better when it comes to decorating. When I'm just by myself in silence, not filming or anything, I could just like my creative juices to start flowing. I like this basket. How much is this? $39.99 and then of course it's 40% off, but it's still hard. It's full of stuff. Making reefs? Oh, 75% off section. Look at this. Well, this 17. It's still high. Let's see. This would have looked cute in a patio. But still. $17. Sometimes the clearance is not really clearance. Yep. Definitely me. Oh, I like this, you guys. This has like little bees. Or no, butterflies or something. $19.99 is 40% off. Yeah, so I kind of need this for one of my cookbooks. But I'm trying to see which one to get. This one is $13.99. This one would have worked just fine. Let's see. How much is this one? Oops. $6.99. We are on a lunch day at Metro Diner. So I think I'm going to order the, let me see, the Philly cheesesteak. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. I'll get the Philly cheesesteak. You'll get the same thing? Uh, no? I thought it was going to be Twinsies. I'm going to want some chicken. Some chicken? Okay. Sounds good. That was delicious. We only ate half of our sandwich. Um, I'm not cooking tonight. I have leftovers in there. I made Mississippi pot roast in the slow cooker yesterday because I was so busy. And um, I made it with mashed potatoes and green beans. So we still have leftovers from that. And then we, John and I have these sandwiches. So that's what we'll have for dinner because I'm not cooking today, guys. I cook pretty much every single day this week. I'm tired. So what are we going to now? Home. Home, yes. I like the sound of that. All right, guys. So it's just me. It's just me now. I just dropped the husband off at home. And I am about to go get my nails done. So you can, they'll do, they do walk-ins now. No more appointments unless you want to. Uh, so hopefully it's not a lot of people in front of me. Now, if you know me, you know that anywhere that I go, I have to always be the first one there. I don't like waiting. I don't like to be waiting for my turn. I go there, so I'm always the first one that gets served. <laughs> not just get served, that sounds terrible. That's not what I mean. What I mean is, um, I like to be in and out. I don't like wait. I don't like waiting. If something opens at night, you best believe I'll be there by 8 45. <laughs> Does that sound bad? It's just the way I am. Maybe it's my anxiety of cutting it close. Of you know, because you never know what can happen, you know, where you can make it somewhere late. So I try not to cut things close. But I'm actually going to get my nails done in the middle of the day, which is crazy to me. I never do that. I was supposed to get it done tomorrow morning. I was, but then I was trying to think of my timeline and the things that I got to do. So if I want to be able to wash my hair and do my braids, tomorrow is the only day I have. And if I wait to get my nails done, that takes a chunk out of my day. So I was like, let me go get it done now. John's at home, so if the kids come home from school, he's already at the house. So that's good. That's the way I think, you guys. I have to schedule everything out. Try to figure out um, what I got going on. And then, of course, I work on Etsy orders. Um, I'm doing my hair tomorrow. I might have to do that. Yeah, I'm doing Destiny's hair this weekend as well. Devin has a Six Flags trip with his youth group from church. It was supposed to be it was last weekend, but we had that storm, so it was canceled. Um, yeah, so he it's this weekend now, and he's looking forward to it. He looking forward to just being him and not his siblings. He told me, which I completely get it. When you're the oldest, you have your siblings with you. But I told him this is his last year of doing the thing by himself because next year, David, I mean David, will be along the same trip with him because David is 16. 16 months younger than Devin. 
Now, most people assume that David is the oldest because he is taller, he is bigger in general. He's not. David is the middle child. David is the oldest. He's just smaller. Um, David is not the oldest child, people. He's the middle child. David takes more after, like physically, after my husband and his side of the family. So, um, yeah. But he is not my oldest. It's Devin. And he acts like my oldest, too. He is so calm and sweet. But yeah, you guys. So that's what we got going on this weekend. My husband has to work on Mother's Day. Um, this is bakery here that has some delicious cupcakes. And they're doing like a charcuterie board. Charcuterie, whatever. You know, that kind of board with a bunch of different stuff on it. And um, it, it has cupcakes and strawberries dipped in chocolate and all kinds of stuff in that um, tray and that's why I told my husband I wanted for Mother's Day. I'm a very simple woman. I don't like I know this sounds weird. I don't like expensive gifts. If that makes sense. I don't know. Like I'm not a gift person. I'm I'm more of acts of service than gifts. Yeah. I, I hope I explained it well. Like, my husband knows me. He knows. It's hard to give me gifts because, like, yeah, I'm not the type that would, like, ask for diamonds and stuff. Like, that's not my thing. But, um, I did one of this charcuterie. <laughs> I'll be jacking that stuff up. Um, my charcuterie. <laughs> not just, it's like a tr how about explain? It's a tray with full of different stuff. It'll have cupcakes. It'll have like salami and a bunch of other stuff in it. And I did like that. So I asked for that. So I'm gonna get that. I know I'm gonna get flowers. And that's about it. I have everything I need. I don't need nothing else. I do. I do. I do want something, and that's some peace and quiet, and be left alone. I just want to lay in my bed and watch some TV. I don't get to do that very often. Um, but that morning we get we go to church and then come home and hopefully I get to lay in bed and do nothing. Fingers crossed. Another thing I forgot to mention, you guys. Okay, the the kids' last day of school is May twenty fifth. So comment down below. Let me know when's your kids' last day of school. So we gotta get those lunch dates in as much as we can because once the kids are home with us, we don't go on lunch dates like that because unless we take the kids with us. We don't have babysitters, and I don't just leave my kids with just anybody. But um, and then Destiny and David's birthday is next month. Destiny's birthday is June 6th. David's is June 11th. So their their birthdays are like just a week a week apart. I remember I told the doctor to induce me with Destiny because I did not want her birthday to land on his day on his birthday because my due date with her was June 13th. Um, and, I, and I had a really big belly when I was pregnant with her. And they thought she was an oversized, like a really big baby. And that's one of the main reasons I got induced with her. Um, guess what, y'all? She ain't only weigh nothing. She weighed six pounds and she was a skinny little thing. And boy, did she scream. She was a screamer. We were looking, John and I were looking at each other like, what's wrong with her? <laughs> oh, she was just screaming like a, like a hyena. Oh, no. Like a banshee. It was funny. <laughs> so I'm finally home. Let me show you guys my nails. They're pretty simple. But this time I made sure they got really short because they were getting way too long for me. I like short nails. Plus when you're making reefs, you don't want your nails to be too long. They hurt once you put your fingers in the wires. So I had to get them nice and short. But this time I got pink. It's so cute. So that's finished i'm home let me show you guys the little thing i don't have any flowers there because it's mother's day is coming up and i already know i'm gonna get some but over here i changed it up you guys so i had the tall um tear tray already decorated for spring but i don't know i just felt like it was getting a little crowded over there so i just wanted to switch it up now this is a tear tray that i kept that i had all the way over here on this side i took that out. i'm about to show you what i have over there and I just redecorated the tear tray. I think this looks super cute. Here 
know what I did is I took away one of the canisters and added some little greenery that I had in one of the tier trays and uh, one of the signs that was in my big tier tray and I just kept it pretty simple over here. I just wanted my countertops cleaner. Like, I just wanted less stuff on my counters. I can't stand clutter. So, don't mind the dishes. I gotta do some dishes. That's a kid's breakfast I kept dishes. it pretty simple. I wanted to switch this thing out. That's why I got the stuff from Hobby Lobby, the easel, because this is a fall one and I don't know. And it's kind of tight in here. I can't, re it's really hard to turn pages. So, I got the one from Hobby Lobby. And which I gotta get is in the garage. And then this is a small tier tray that I got from Target Dollars Bar like a few months ago, never used it. And this is what I have in here. So pretty simple. I just wanted my countertops pretty clean. Right here, you guys know that I normally keep the um, canisters here. So I just added the flower canister on the countertop because it goes with everything else and just added my baking my KitchenAid on this corner I just feel like it looks really good so there. that is what I ended up doing yesterday so I um I cleaned my bathrooms and everything I just didn't even bother filming I just wanted to get it done because I had a small amount of time to do it so I, I did that and just moved some things around I didn't buy any new decor or anything I just got some things out of my decor container that I switch out and move some things to different rooms and that's it. New decor. So I switched out the easel and yes, this is much, much better. I like this. They had a white one, but for some reason the white one was more. This was $6.99 and the white one was $12.99. Why? All right, y'all, so we getting ready to leave out the house again, only that we got the entire crew. Hey, y'all. Wait, oh yeah, cause you got our stuff. Yes, that's why. <laughs> I gotta go, today's the last day. I, I gotta go to Bath and Body Works okay. and get the um, plug-in refills. And today's the last day. If not, I would've put it off for another day. Um, so we're gonna do that and somewhere else. You guys will so see. So you guys, we are at PetSmart. Finally taking the kids. Yes. Huh? Oh, David, there's this colorful project. There's like, a mermaid in there. I like that one. There's nothing in there. I like this one. Yeah. I mean, not this one. Oh, that is cute. I like that. Yeah, me too. They're goldfish. Daddy. Oh, yeah. I do. Oh, John, remember this one, the bug eye one? Yeah. yeah. Ooh, That's Daddy, come look. Look at the tree, babe. It's nice. Yeah, look. Yeah. The bug eye. The bug eye? Look at it. Oh, Mom, I definitely got one of these. Which one? Let me see. Mom, it looks like the beach. This one looks like the beach. Darren said he wants one of these one day. How much is that one? I'm doing the fishy distance. They're like... <laughs> so they're black more that I used to That's what I was just telling you. This is the one you used to eat. I used to really like these. Ten bucks. Oh, bro. What of those fish was like our longest lasting fish. It lasted five months. That's a long time. I know. I see one scratching around. Hey, mommy, can we go over there now? Because we have one that's like. Okay. I like these, though. The glow in the dark ones. I love those. They look so pretty. It's like if you had to, like, to paint it wrong. There's one that dead already caught in the thing. Aww, so poor thingy. But making that one, let's go look for it. I don't see the other one, though. Maybe it's a different thing. Yeah. Yeah, it's right there. Let me see. Oh, look, it's a crab. It's, it's red crab. crab. Yeah. Look at that. I don't think we get any more fish for a long time. I know. Maybe we can try next time. What did, where did they even leave it? Oh, Mom, look. I like it. Oh, I see them. I don't see them. Oh, right here. See I see it. Hermit crabs. Hermit crabs. I don't see any. Mom, you know what I learned? Well, I don't eat any hermit 
crab is actually bad. Oh, they're You said what? There. Having any hermit crab is bad. That's Why? hermit crab. Because they, you don't give up the, the amount of space they need. They need like huge. Well, well, they don't have that much space right here. It's you know, snails. Ooh, I see a fat one. <laughs> it's snails. It's Look, that's everywhere. leaving. Everywhere. So we are already home, and I'm gonna show you guys some of the plugins that I got. So this is the Endless Weekend. These are like my favorites, especially this one, the Eucalyptus Mint. What else? Fiji White Sand. Um, yeah, Speechy White Sands. And what else? Did I get a different one? And Cucumber Lily. I, I like some other ones too, but I only got 10 this time. Um, and then they haven't been having good sales though, y'all. It takes them forever to get a sale. And when they do, it's like $3.95. Like, and they don't do coupons anymore. What happened? So, my husband and I were talking in a car because I told him, like, this is for the birds. We might have to switch over to the Febreze one that I was looking at the commercials for and it's a lot cheaper that way and they have a bunch of different varieties on amazon and target so we might switch over with the household sense the only thing is i love about bath and water works is the plugins like they get so pretty and stuff is you done or is you done <laughs> It's almost shower time, ma'am. You gotta go to school tomorrow. But, um, yeah, we were talking about maybe replacing them with another one. If you guys have another good plug-in that you all love, please leave me a comment down below and let and su give me some suggestions of the ones that if you have something different mm -hmm. and you know it works well and lasts a long time, and when you come up in the house, you can actually smell it, let me know, you guys. And there's seven. <laughs> That would be hiding from the camera. It's not like I'm trying to avoid him. He just doesn't like being filmed. But I hope you all in. They, they know I got TikTok. Y'all, uh, y'all, I have been falling down really hard down the TikTok hole. Like I'm just sitting there just looking at TikTok videos. And this is what I was afraid of. So that's what I've been doing. But I hope you all enjoy this vlog don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already and keep a lookout for my next videos guys bye